not just in a recession, but at any time, cost consciousness is important. But cost reduction can put you out of business. It's not that the cost doesn't matter, but it's the real cost, the overall cost that's important. To use all resources wisely, you have to understand how they're connected. How raw material connects with machines, connects with methods, with workflow, and people, including customers. Let me share an example. A company decides it needs to order some resource books. Since they're resource books, they're kind of expensive. About $100 each. There's uh, six employees per department, and there's four departments. So the department manager's ordering one book for each employee in their department. Put an order that totals to $2,400. That's six times four equals 24 times 100. Now, orders come down from management to cut costs. So the purchaser, trying to do his job as directed, sees that with four departments, why does each department need six books? What he proposes instead and what he orders is one book at 100 bucks per department. That equals only a $400 expenditure, which is a savings of $2,000. From a cost-cutting standpoint, that's true. But is it a true from a real cost standpoint, an overall cost standpoint? Because as it ends up, everybody in the department needs to use the book. And because of there is only one book in the department and six people that are sharing that book, each person spends about 30 minutes a day, twice a day, or about one hour just waiting to get the book. Now, with one book, meaning one person is able to use it at a time, that leaves five people per department times four departments equals 20 hours a day lost to waiting for the book times an average about $20 an hour equals about $400 in loss daily. That means if you take Two thousand. The savings that the was made in the purchase, and you divide that by four hundred, which is the uh, wasted money spent in labor. You get five days, which means that it only takes one week until all that savings of $2,000 is gone. And given that this book was a listing of people in the industry, and it needs to be constantly updated because people change. We live very fluid times. It's always a different person, a different name. That book was usually changed about every six months, half a year. That means that after one week, the savings is gone. But for another 25 weeks, six months minus one week, which was paid for by the savings, the company is losing $2,000 a week or in a six-month period $50,000. It's incredible. 
it's kind of like the gift that keeps on losing you save 2000 to lose 50000 so you can see very clearly how cost cutting can put you out of business but the losses just don't stop at the money lost in labor cost what does it do to the morale of the people that are working that the company is willing to have them waste an hour of their day how many opportunities are lost because the information that was needed in the book wasn't uh, available so our tip is to become cost conscious instead of cutting costs cost cutting looks at only one small part of the puzzle